welcome to WiseLink Academy. For today, I'm going to be considering um, a problem under tangency. As you can see, the figure at the right hand side of the screen, that figure is a spanner, right? So, we want to reproduce out that figure by applying the principle of tangency. First thing first, my first thing to do as illustrated in diagram is to draw my horizontal line right so if i have my t square this way and i place my t square on my paper i will draw horizontal line long one short one long one short one long one short one short one long one short one long one short one i have this so this horizontal line is what you are seeing my arrow indicating at the right hand side of the screen right so my next task is to um, take my 60 degree set square also called 30 degree set square this way and draw an inclined 30 degree this way right i have this so where they meet at this point here right at this point with, is that point you are seeing my arrow indicating right such that i will place my t square this way at this point and draw um, a line downwards this way as you can see what i have now this is point this point is where you are seeing my arrow indicating now my next task is that if you observe closely at point um, there is a distance of 40 20 then 20 downwards 20 upward if i measure out 20 on my meter rule from year to year it's given to be 20 right i will place it at this point strike an arc here also strike an arc here which sum up to what 40 so next up i will draw a parallel line a line like this to this and to this upper one this way right if i draw it this way take my t square my set square this way turn that my t square i'll draw this this way next up i will draw at this point draw it this way right i'll draw it that way now where it meets at this point here at this point is that point you are seeing my indicating at that point here there's an arc of what of 50 r50 right so i will measure r50 on my meter rule if i measure r50 from here to here is given to be r50 right so at this point right i'll strike an arc on this 30 degree i did initially right so i haven't done that i'll place my um, compass at this point then what strike an arc this way a faint arc right next up at this other point two strike an arc this way the faint line so i have what you are seeing in front of you now my next task is to um take my set square this way at this point here right i will join it to this point here this point to this point this way right next up this point to this point this way so my next start is taking out this point from here to here i'll taking it next up from here to this point i will taking it as you can see what i am having now we are on track so my next task here is to observe um this is 50 right and 50 downwards now if you observe closely there's an arc of what 30 there's an arc of 30 32 somewhere here such that that arc there's an other arc of what 50 r50 so i'll simply minus 50 from 32 if i do that by calculation if i subtract 50 from 32 i'll have 18 right so i'll measure 18 my meter rule 
from here to here 18 1.8 right now at this point here i'll strike this place arc this way now i will now measure what that out 32 32 from this point to this point is 32 right at this point here where you strike the arc get it to touch um this um, um arc here this way this way as you can see as you can see what i did right next up if you observe also there is an arc of 38 here 38 here was 32 here is not 38 so minus 38 38 from 50 i will have 12 so I'll measure 12 1.2 from this point to this point 1.2 at this point here yeah, strike this arc here yeah, at this point next up i will now measure 38 initially as given in the um di dimension from here to here it's going to be what 38 now at this point here yeah, i will ensure that i get it to touch this this way i have this i have this as you can see what is in front of you so my next task is that if you observe closely there's an arc that covers this place r50 so i will measure um r50 on my meter rule right so if i can produce out that r50 here is what i need to do Tax now is that i need to produce out there's an arc here called R, r50 as you can see my arrow indicating so to produce that um 50 i need to take my compass at this point to this point right at this center point from here to here was 18 initially at the center point here at this place strike an arc here to touch that 30 degree with rod initially similarly from this point here to this point was given to be 12 by a calculation so from at this point here called the arc where the arc meets at this point i would measure that 50. so from here to here this is 50. so at this center point here i will connect the arc together this way so i can thicken it now right similarly from this point here I will extend it to this point to take in this part here. Right, similarly, this point here to take in this point here. As you can see, so at this point here, close this up to thick line. Similarly, at this point, I close this part up to it. A thick line this way so see so we have to what produce out the um head of that spanner right so my next task now is to observe closely right um at this point let me show you what i'm saying what i'm doing if you observe closely right now if you observe distance from this from, from this other point to somewhere down here is 200 so i will take my meter rule from this point here right so from this point here from this point here down here is going to be what 200 so i'll just draw this downward right downward similarly come to this point right at this point here i'll draw this downward right it simply means from here to here is 200 as illustrated in the diagram so my next task now is that if you observe this and radius of 15 at this point so i'll measure 15 um for my meter rule so with my compass from here to here is 15 right so i'll similarly just put it here at this point draw um arc this way arc of 15 
this way as you can see now next task is that i will take this edge like this down this way to touch this line i drew similarly i'll take this also down this way so i have this right as you can see in front of you so my next task now is that if you observe closely there is an arc right entering this um straight line here yeah? if you observe there is an arc of what 38 so for me to produce that arc that arc is an external arc so for every external arc what do we do we simply what add now before i can start producing that arc if you observe that arc was what it's going to be what 38 so i will measure 38 in my compass now from this point here the diameter root from this point here to this point here is 38 right so at this point i'll strike an arc upward also come down here strike an arc downward this way if you observe closely the arc here too is going to be what 38 so i'll make sure this line touch that arc so at this point this way right i'll ensure that this way so the straight line has caught this place now i'll extend this point downward and this point to downward this way so i'll be having this by illustration touch this place similarly i'll take this point here downward to touch this point this way right so this is 38 also 38 downwards so we said we are adding what we are adding 38 with what 50 so if i add 38 with 50 i will have 88 so i will measure 88 my meter rule from this point to this point here is 88 88 to this point here is 88 so at this point listen at this point at this point rather at this point strike an arc right i will erase this similarly at this same point here strike another arc here i will erase this so i have what you are seeing in front of you so at this point i will get it this way i will get it this way as you can see this way similarly at this point here i will also get it i will get it this way i'll get it this way so i don't get it i will make sure i close it up the tip line this way as you can see Next stop, I will close the top. Close the top. This way. Um, there's. Sorry. I'll do it this way. As illustrated in the diagram. Right. So. Alright, we have successfully replicate what you are seeing at the right corner of the screen right to be um this right if you have found this video helpful kindly click on the social button and like also share to your friends and classmates thank you and welcome to wise link academy